Hello everybody, Zach here, and welcome back to another Chase Me in a Mod Showcase. Today we're going to be in this Fiesta, uh, this WRC style slash Ken Block um, style Fiesta. Uh, I've done this one up in what is very similar to the orange that came on the STs. Um, got a little bit of red in it, but it's, you know, mostly orange. I can't change the wing color or anything. I've changed the wheels to white. I think it looks cool. And I put the plates on. They are extras. But yeah, you can basically take this one and make it more, oh, I would say, arguably overall street looking in this form comparative to uh, the watch the dog there, a comparative to the Hoonigan with like the Ken Block down the side and Ford Performance slash the WRC, which is the MSRT, I believe is the team. Um, yeah, got more into not saying I've watched any of it or followed any of it, but uh, I've checked out more, you know, crazy spec slash, you know, actual performance fiestas uh, since purchasing mine, which is, you know, a bone stock nearly, uh, not a performance model, quote unquote. Well, it's a performance model, but it's not, you know, a race spec or rally spec or anything. This thing handles pretty well, though. Um, I drove it already, and the only thing I upgraded was the brakes. Stock wise, they are not enough um for this car so i upgraded upgraded those to the max that you can i didn't change anything else so everything else handling wise or uh honestly yeah visual wise is how it comes so yeah let's see how this goes let's i think we're gonna start off with two stars i'm not doing any type of challenges i was considering doing keep that you know stay off road challenge with this but it's got actually a good you know mixed uh performance in terms of being able to be on the road and on the dirt so i think it'll be perfect for a chase me uh it gets blindingly bright out and it's gonna start raining and oh my god it's really foggy too a little bit foggy out here all right and now it's like pink okay so there's some weather weather in today's chase me we're gonna put up with that uh no problem we're gonna go to player options though and give ourselves two stars and see how that goes how do you guys think it'll go uh, I got some stuff ordered for the Fiesta. That's nothing that's really power, um, you know, focused. Uh, like I've already said, I got already have the Cobb uh, access port, and I've already just done the, you know, stage one off the shelf tune. Um, I know there's a lot of people that have already told me, and I appreciate it, um, you know, switching over to somebody else's tune, and I will be doing that uh, probably once I change out one of the things I ordered, which is the radiator. Um, because like I said, you know, it's one of those things where definitely on these, I say cooler, but you know, sub 95 plus degree days, the radiator has pretty much no problem keeping up with the, uh, stock internals. Um, it's only when it's hotter than that and you're really pushing it. And I tend to be the type of person that pushes it. No surprise <laughs> as we flip. All right, cool. Thank you. Thank you for that blues brothers moment. Hopefully I don't lose my wheels or, or windows or both today. <laughs> um, no, but for real, uh, what was I going to say? Yeah. Radiator. Um, yeah. Went and ordered the mountain one because supposedly it's just that much better. And then I'll have that overhead that I want. And, uh, yeah, probably shortly after that coming in and getting that installed, uh, we may go, you know, intercooler and exhaust and, uh, see what, see where we're at there. So yeah, fun stuff though. I, I do plan on making an update video and maybe even a video after, you know, I get that radiator installed and maybe make a video trying to kind of push the limits at first and then going right over here. Yes. Look at that. That was easy. Like there was nothing to it. No, but if you guys do want to follow that kind of stuff, of course, you know, follow me on all my socials. Um, I usually have them, you know, down in the description, but also pretty easy to find me if you just search my name on the social platforms shouldn't be many other fake accounts there definitely are some and I, I usually try to get them removed pretty quick or if people tell me about them all right so three stars going through the military base this is where it gets usually pretty crappy i don't usually go through this way so i'm trying to kind of like sneak out here with no tank interaction and it looks like i'm gonna have no tank interaction today Wait, did I lose three stars in there? What? 
Maybe I was already losing two. Didn't even realize it when I was trying to set it to three. Okay, well, hey, we set ourselves back up to three. And we got the military coming right there. Um, <laughs> funny enough. Let's go up through here. Yeah, I'm still really enjoying the Fiesta exa for exactly one of the reasons I buy it. So, of course, I'm fortunate enough to do this and not have to, you know, have a daily commute. Um, so don't get me wrong. I'm not putting on the miles that I would if I had a commute otherwise. And there's, you know, the, the whole reason I'm driving the car is for fun and to, you know, be essentially a grocery getter. And it's been perfect for that so far. And, uh, I like it and I'm excited too for some of the stuff that I'm working on with it that I'm not going to tell you about the guys about yet. I'm really excited. Will it look anything like this? No, but <laughs> I think it'll, I think we'll do some cool things, you know, visually. Oh God, they're shooting at me from that. Oh, hey, those signs actually helped me there. Go through that turn. Man, is it nasty out? And also this thing just pushes. Um, it's all wheel drive for sure, but it just can't. Uh, I guess if I, I don't know, handling wise, it's interesting. It's uniquely realistic, more, more on the realistic side for definitely for a GTA car. I mean, for, I know it's a modded car, but I'm, what I'm saying is a lot of them tend to lean towards more of what GTA's physics do. Um, this is a mix, I feel like, because it's definitely doing things that for GTA, of course it has to, it's in this physics engine, but then it is you know, a more fighty, I don't know. Cool. Cool dynamics. Some actual dynamics. And it's not just wanting to flip right over. I say that and I feel like I'm going to go down a mountain like this and I'm just going <laughs> to go sideways and just flip right over. This is one of those times where, you know, I'm glad I didn't turn off the weather, but at the same time, man, yeah, I tend to like it when we just have, you know, clear skies, but hey, this does add another challenge too. Definitely in a car like this, it was very appropriate that it started to rain. This is fun. This is fun though. Oh, <laughs> not so much fun to just head right on into him. How was your guys' uh, 4th of July weekend too? I've been, um, didn't do much, but uh, we kind of hung out and got some stuff done around the place. Uh, we ended up going out. Uh, well, yeah, I guess that would have been the night of July 4th. Uh, I'm just going out to uh, stay on here. Oh my God, here we go. Here we go. This is not good. This is where it goes all wrong. Whenever we're down in one of these, this is when it's all wrong. I did want to, uh, and I'm going to try to live stream probably tomorrow, honestly, Wednesday, um, ATS. I want to get another camera angle set up, but I was going to do it today, but, uh, just need a different mount. I don't have to find it because I'm still not completely moved into this office. <laughs> oh man. Going really fast there. This thing is able to handle itself though. Off road, man, it's brilliant. Oh, we had a little bit of that air action. Okay. Okay. Come on. You know where I want to go. You know where I feel like this is suited for, right? At least that's how I feel. Also, it's so loud in game when it rains. Got my system volume down and I'll have to bring this down in post too. Like, it's just so loud. Okay. Oh, baby. No, don't go into the sea. Don't go into the sea or under the sea. Um, I was considering going up that way, but I think I want to go up the other side. Oh, I'm not deaf. Thank you. I just don't want to listen to you. My idea is to go through here. Oh God, I was fearful that that was, it just keeps sending them that way. That's very annoying. They follow me, damn it. Okay, I'm trying to go up this way here. 
Oh, ho, 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 ho. Go towards the park here. We only have three, too. Man, I swore this this feel this like feels like four. Come on. Oh, come on, baby. Oh. Alright, we're gonna go up to four. We're gonna go through this tunnel. We're gonna up the challenge. Up the Annie. No, did they really spawn them right there? <gasps> <laughs> oh my god the jerks though really really hey that benefited me actually oh my god this is probably the worst place to up it because that was not good <laughs> oh my gosh you know what we're gonna use this little switch back here oh there's a freaking long there I just felt like this would be super appropriate to drive just straight up the side of in this. And then honestly, this would be able to do it. And it does appear so with ease. Like the speed I'm getting up here is like nothing else would just be able to do this. Nothing. We are up the side. Oh, look at that. The fog actually looks really cool. Go, 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 go. This is actually, honestly, oh, damn helicopter. I was about to say, best chance we have of losing them, too. Oh, no, that's not good. Hopefully, I can save myself here. Oh, it's slickery. It's slickery. It seriously is super slip, slick <laughs> and slippery. Oh, my God. Come on. No, stay on there. This is going is what it's doing. I was about to say, not necessarily. Oh, look at the gold piping. Wait, where is the engine at, though? Oh, it's down in there. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, we're good. I just keep matting the gas, and that seems to be working out. So far, so good. Who knew that this is just going to be this horrible weather the entire time in here? Go, 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 go. Okay, I think we're good. Because... No, we're still not good, though. These helicopters... There's no way I can lose these helicopters unless I start returning. Oh, my God. That was, like, right about an action movie. Tough action to an action movie. John Madden. Come on, John. This is just... I'm, I'm driving up the entire mountain very poorly, I might add. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, do her. I lost the front clip, but that's fine. We, we uh... Wow. Wait. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if there's a radiator on the front of this. Oh, my God. Doesn't look like there is. This is a rough section too. Oh, they're not killed me yet. So also, you know, everybody that's just like, I've got armor on or whatever. No, if the, if the vehicle protects me, it's the vehicle. Like it's, it's the modeling of the vehicle or, or what have you, or how bad the aim is or how good clearly game is of the LSPD that day. You know, it's a combination of those. I, I don't put God mode on. I don't put armor on my car or myself at some point. You know, back when these were LSPDFR chase me's or whatever they were, amalgamation, which I'm an amalgamation now. Um, yeah, I don't put that on. I mean, maybe back in the day I did, but I do not do that now. I want the challenge to be 100% my driving skills or sometimes lack thereof. Wow, it is uh, dark. Well, I guess because it's nighttime. And then it also is just pouring, downpour, can't see very good. And here we go. And these two helicopters just continually unloading into us. Not good. I don't see any other vehicles though up or down this. It makes sense until I get towards the bottom where they're actually able to kind of get up on the ribbon. Ribbon. <laughs> I don't know why I said the ribbon and why I also just was like, 
I held on to it though. So this is trying, I'm just trying to go down this mountain. First person is puke nation. Oh, they're here. Like I said, they, they kind of get down to a certain portion and then they're able to kind of spawn them back in, I guess. This is technically a road to them. Uh, just them, obviously. Oh, I'm just trying to hold on to it. Try not to go down so the sliding slippery bits here. It's very slippery. God. I also can't see squat. Oh, no, 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 no. That's where. No, 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 no. I'm just kind of along for the ride here. That kids is why you wear your seatbelt. <laughs> Look. Un unharmed. Sorry, I have to put the disclosure that all of this is uh, commentary or not commentary, but for comedic purposes and none of the stunts here or in any of Zach Halsnick's videos should be attempted to be attempted even in a game, let alone in real life. Right? Do I have to put that in there? Well, I did. I said it at least. All right. So I guess the tires are definitely indestructible. Again, not a bad thing. Oh, those posts are very slowing or, or, or do I have a pop tire? It's just the exhaust. Oh no, tires are definitely poppable. I'm pretty sure is, from, is what I'm hearing. Yep, left rear, I think. Yeah, for sure, 100%. That's not good. We're definitely screwed. Yeah, no, no, no. That's not good on this car, too. The way it puts the power down, the way that it uses that handling. Okay, we're dead. So we just kind of got to try to mitigate our losses here. God, this thing is still so fast and still does have overall good handling ability, considering the state that it's in. They're just all out, though. That definitely would have waterlocked something. Probably the engine, but it would have water, water like something. Okay, we've done this before. Oh no. Oh, my seatbelt. We've definitely done this before though. Uh, I think, oh, I was about to say this van is definitely, I'm hot wiring it. What in the hell? It was here and it was running. I'm very surprised that I even got that far with it. It's so dark. Okay, at least I have working lights now, though. I can at least see where I'm at. Um, I do only have a police van, though. Did the last time I do this, did I steal a Rombo or did I just try to steal a police car? Or what did I steal? Oh, that is an indestructible sign, damn it. Not good. It is still pouring here at night now. The van has so little everything other than armor. And here we go. We're going to have the whole department behind us. I going to say, what does it look like when I turn the lights on? Yeah, they're not very useful. Now I have no headlights. Not even one headlight. No headlights. Okay. Oh, that was a lot more graphic than I expected. Is this also because I didn't keep moving, so it didn't have as much of the comedic effect as I wanted? And go around that roadblock. It's perfect because right here, I just got right through it. Oh! No. All right, I'm going to try to get a different car here. But that's not going to happen. That's how we do things. This looks like a 5PD ending, let's be honest, with all of the cars. 
and everybody just standing around me, pointing guns at me. If they were continually still shooting, it would really truly be the end of a 5 PD. I'm gonna revive myself, and there we go. Everything's gone except for the van that I had. Well, guys, that was a fun, that was a fun video. Fun chase me. Um, if you want the car, link will be in the description. I think it's from a year or two ago. Um, it's still going to model them nonetheless, and uh, has a lot more options, and you can make it. This guy's tailgating me. What do you, what do you think this is? I'm going to pull him over. Pull that. Heave over. But yeah, this was fun regardless, and uh, I don't know. Always a good time doing chase me's. Let me know if there's any cars or anything out there you would like to see in an upcoming video or any other stuff you would like to see uh like i said hey make sure you follow me on social media for real not to pimp it out so much but that's where i put you know other than the youtube community page i'm putting that i'm live on on specifically twitter uh sometimes on the instagram like the the story feed so make sure you follow me on there and then like i said if you're interested in car stuff if you have an interest to follow the fiesta and see what i do to it make sure you follow me on social media too because i'll post the intermediate stuff before you know, actual big stuff or, or different changes to the Fiesta. So, all right. Appreciate you guys. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.